I thought I'd film a quick intro to this video. I decided this week I'm going to document my workouts. Don't look at me for form, all right? There's, I was watching the footage back and I was like, oh, I can fix this and oh, I can fix this. But that's why, that's one of the reasons why I'm doing this is so that I can watch myself back and I can see what I need to fix. Because a lot of times I notice, I'll think I'm doing something a certain way and then I'll watch myself back and then I'm not doing it that way. So for me, this is a really good learning experience and I recommend it to you too. This is also just kind of like, I'm, I'm just trying to document what I'm doing in my fit. I, I just, I think it's interesting to see. I'll be able to look back on this and be like, oh wow, that's so cool. That's where I was at and this is where I am. It allows me to see my growth. It allows you to see my growth. And, and it just, I don't know. I just think it's a good way to share what I'm doing and then maybe you take a couple things that you like from what I did and you use it yourself. All right, so here is my first outfit this week. I love these leggings. I got them from Fabletics. Now, there's a story behind these. I didn't order them and I hated them initially because they're white on the inside. And so like they stretch and then they turn white. And I, I still don't super love that. I decided to just accept it for what it is because they're just so cute. These sat in my closet for way too long because Listen, you know when you're like, oh yes, I'm going to return it. And then it just sits in your closet and then you don't return it. Um, yummy yeah, too. <laughs> Essentially that's what happened here. But it turned out in my favor and I love them. And I just think they're so flattering. Like they kinda they kinda suck in the little poochy pooch. They kinda give your booty a little bootiness. I don't have a big booty, but I have a little booty. And they're just super cute. So that's where the leggings came from. This top is just from Amazon. The back is very open. My bra doesn't match, but the outfit, but also show you, ignore the bra. Listen, I'm working out at home. It's fine. Don't stress out about it. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it, sweetheart. So I just really like this outfit. I think it's super cute. I did put my hair up in a ponytail because um, I'm probably gonna be jump roping later and I just need something that is gonna just stay. And this will just stay. All right. So here we have me doing some um, Romanian deadlifts, some RDLs, if you will. I used this big old thing of water. I could have used my dumbbells, but I think this is heavier, so I use that. You got to use what you can. I thought it was pretty thrifty. I'm sure other people are doing this too, though. I did find this. It's kind of a weird shape. So I don't know. I don't love like the range of motion that I had, but you know, I did what I had to do. Now, okay, here are my squats. I'm very self-conscious of my squats. I don't know if it's, I have janky knees. I don't know. I watch so many videos on how to fix your squat. I can't figure it out. I've tried. I don't know. So now I'm trying like a chair. I didn't love the chair. I'm just, I'm really trying to figure out what's wrong with my squats. I don't know. But again, I have janky knees. They're like knock knees. So I don't know if it's that. I don't know if it's my ankles. I don't know. Um, these are, these were going to be goblin squats and then I forgot to pick up a weight and so this is goblin squats, sorry, goblet, I call them goblin squats without the weight. So I don't know, just like a really wide stance squat situation. Really hits the booty. We love that. Okay, next, I don't know what these are called, but I did them. All the um, exercises that you're going to see, I did... Three sets, 10 reps. That's typically what I always do. So, and with these, I did um, 10 on each side three times. Also with the weight, I did put a weight on it. Um, and I tried to really make sure that my hand was just holding it to my leg and that my hand wouldn't actually like lift up the weight because I wanted my leg to lift the weight, not my hand. I'm trying to work some side booty action. I don't know what that's called. Okay, these are, shoot, hip thrusts. These ones are, I get those and glute bridges mixed up. These are hip thrusts, I think. I don't know. Probably. With my tw little, my cute little 12 pounds. Cute. All right, now we're to the cardio portion. Today, I did some jump rope. I've been working on my jump rope. It's still not where I want it to be. Y'all jump roping? is hard. I'm so glad I got this jump rope. I love my jump rope. I, what I've been working on is getting rid of my little double jump and just doing a single jump like this. Um, for some reason, that's a lot harder for me. I can go a lot longer when I do a little double jump. I don't know what that's about, but 
y'all, if you want some good cardio, do that. Finally, I've, I've incorporated stretching into my routine. Um, I'm not flexible at all. Um, also sometimes I kind of just make up stretches a little bit. So, you know, it hurts. (laughs) And I'm going to be honest, I did feel a little bit weird about posting this, but that's really it for today. Um, I hope maybe this inspires you, gives you some ideas. Honestly, as long as you're moving at this point, you're doing great. You got to be a little bit creative. You got to just kind of get your body moving. Got to get things going. But I got to tell you, this really improved my mood. I didn't want to do it before. And then afterwards, I was like, oh, that was so good for me. So I hope you have a great day. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Until next time. Bye, y'all.